Today's Black History Maker features Lily May, the CEO and founder of the Glambitious I Am brand. Welcome to this edition of Today's Black History Makers, and I am super excited to share with you this incredible woman, Lily May, who is the founder of Glambitious I Am brand, and she's going to tell you a little bit about that. Uh, welcome, Lily May. Thank you for being here. And thank you for having me. I'm excited to chat with you. Oh, so as the CEO of Dream Big with Sherry, I am always interested in learning how big other people can think. And as a fellow dreamer, I'd love to ask you, Lily Mae, what is your big beyond imagination dream, this hairy, big, audacious goal, whatever you want to call it, to impact the world? Yes, you know, I would like to have an Oprah sized impact. And I, I feel like that's probably among the biggest impact we can imagine in this day and age is an Oprah sized impact. And, you know, she's created opportunities for people globally. And, you know, I just hope and aim to do the same through my brand. Oh, I love that. And I can say that you are doing that because I've participated in a lot of those things. And we're going to talk about how other people can be part of that in just a little bit. But as you are already making history today, as we speak, who is it that was a black historic trailblazer that inspired your journey that you feel like paved the way for your success? Sure. I would actually have to say uh, Maya Angelou. Um, as a child, I actually was a member of the same church that she was a member of. So she was my first introduction to like a global phenom that I could actually touch and see and hear. And she would speak at our church often during the church anniversaries or special engagements. She actually brought Oprah to our church once and she brought Janet Jackson to our church once. So, you know, she was my first uh up close and personal introduction to a person that, you know, can come from very humble beginnings and still have an impact on the world uh, completely, you know, in, in her lifetime and even beyond her passing, you know, she is a legend. And so that, that was one of my biggest inspirations. Oh, I love it. It gave me goosebumps. I'm so <laughs> I'm green. <laughs> Oh my gosh. So obviously, as you are already making history today, uh, which we've already heard, if we were to fast forward 50 to 75 years, uh, Lily May, what would someone be saying about you, about the impact that you've had on them? Meaning, how would you like to be remembered and what legacy do you want to leave? Yeah, you know, I would like to be remembered as a vessel of God, because that's what I am. Um, and I would like to be remembered for just bringing people joy and inspiration. Um, outside of what I do business-wise, I have quite a personality. So anyone that's engaged with me in person, they're usually always laughing, um, you know, because I could be a silly billy. So, and even through my events and the things that I have, you know, I try to bring a bit of joy and laughter to people. I think that sometimes life can get very difficult and challenging and it could be so serious as an adult that we forget just to, you know, get back to that inner child. And so I would hope people definitely remember me for my bright spirit or my contagious energy, because I really have had a zest for life. And I really have, you know, really tried to operate in excellence. I've really tried to allow God to use me for his glory, to inspire women. And, you know, as I said, similar to my Angelo, I come from extremely humble beginnings where, you know, I would wake up in the middle of the night and people are shooting guns outside. Like I've seen people shoot at each other. I've, you know, seen people fight a lot. I've seen people do drugs, like anything you could imagine. I've likely seen it as a child. And so to be able to, you know, have the grace on my life that I've had to be able to impact people and have some of the experiences that I've had, it's, it's truly been a blessing. And I just hope that, you know, people remember me as just a vessel of God that operated in her purpose with nothing but purely pure intentions to, to, you know, be a positive light in people's lives. Oh my goodness. Oh, heart. That was amazing. Thank you. So if somebody wants to learn more about 
Glambitious I Am brand. Uh, I, I How would they reach out to you and how would they connect with you, Lily? Sure. My website is theglamceo.com. And so if you visit there, you'll see a ton of ebooks, webinars, opportunities to speak on my platform, opportunities to be interviewed, money making opportunities. So I definitely encourage you to visit my site, theglamceo.com. And then you can also connect with me on social media at glambitious I A M or at I am Lily May. And, and if you have any questions about anything, feel free to email me, glambitiousmember at gmail.com. Wow, thank you so much. And as you can well see, why Lily May is one of today's Black history makers is because she is making a difference in the world with her bright light. Thank you, Lily May, for being with us today. Thank you. Until the next episode of today's Black History Maker, we'll see you next time.